Well, let's take a look here at the uh, radar. You can see there are showers and thunderstorms. I'm going to uh, freeze the radar so we can look at the current view and then zoom in up there uh, to the zoo. And there's a look and it's dry right now. It is uh, still going to be windy uh, out there, but uh, you don't have to be concerned about rain early in the day if you're headed up there or if you know someone who's headed up there right now we're looking at temperatures that are in the 70s everywhere except Lapeer. Lapeer has now slipped down to 69 degrees as you're stepping outside in Troy 77 degrees in Detroit 78 and right now Metro is at 76. These are temps that are at or above where we were yesterday. It's already a warm start to the day with winds out of the south at 5 to 10 miles an hour. Now we're dry outside at the moment. We've had some showers and thunderstorms including some pretty good ones here passing by uh, through parts of uh, the Saginaw Valley and clipping parts of the thumb Tuscola and Huron counties. We know don't have to worry about that right now. There'll be a slight chance of a shower along the north of I 69 for this morning. I'm more concerned about this afternoon, and that's for everyone uh, with the chance for showers and storms. You can see sort of a broken line here. There's a little boundary. It's cooler to the north of that boundary, but for us, it is hot and humid once again today, and there is a lot of moisture in the air. You know, when you step outside and you're thinking, man, it's really humid. Well, when the thunderstorms come through and wring out all that moisture during the afternoon hours, too, four o'clock, six and eight o'clock. Anytime during that time frame, that's when we'll have a really good chance at elevated rain chances and downpour. So you can see here during the morning hours, not a whole lot of activity going on. Maybe a shower far north. Then during the afternoon hours, one o'clock, two o'clock, we start to see thunderstorms develop. Uh, the best chance for that is going to be one or two and beyond. One looks like it would just be when things would start and we would get some of these downpours. Not expecting severe weather, just locally heavy rain that could cause some localized flooding. So if you're making your plans for this afternoon, make sure you have an alternative to go inside. If it's a last minute cookout, uh, you just want to make sure that you're not washed out. Have an indoor plan as a backup. 90 degrees your high today, hot and humid with afternoon and evening thunderstorms. Tonight we're down to 72. Tomorrow back near uh, 90 degrees. We're near 90 each afternoon for Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. And we're a little drier though for the next couple of days, including back to school. Today is the wettest day in the forecast with a 70% rain chance.